Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a cook and clean with me video where you basically follow me around as I clean my apartment as well as cook dinner. Now I'm super excited because this is actually a collab with one of my favorite YouTubers. You guys, she's amazing. It is the Paige Danielle. <laughs> she is so much fun. She puts out amazing content. Fun fact, she's also from North Carolina, but she has a way cooler accent than I do. If you don't know what I mean, you definitely need to check out her channel and you'll see what I'm talking about. Here's a little sneak peek of her video and I will also have her linked down below. Definitely go check out her video whenever you're done watching this one and let her know that Lauren sent you. And I really hope that you guys enjoy the videos that we put together. You better turn up. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rockin' if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead. Go and catch me, baby.
you think about all the ways I'm making you smile. I know I am what you need, and boy, you're just my type. Deep down, I know you want it. You wanna take a leap and jump in. Oh, oh, oh. We're gonna fall in love. You
tortillas, some um, sliced turkey, some bacon, you can use regular bacon or turkey bacon, um, sharp cheddar cheese, you can use any cheese but I think cheddar tastes the best with this recipe, spinach, um, once again this can be substituted for like lettuce, romaine lettuce, um, tomatoes, ranch, and salt and pepper. And then for the actual potatoes, I used, um, it says that these are like the express potatoes that you can cook in the microwave. I just cooked them normally, these were just the cheapest ones. And then olive oil, and then oregano and basil, as well as this Mrs. Dash. Um, I just ended up only using the Mrs. Dash because it has amazing flavor. I didn't even use the basil or oregano. So to begin with, I'm just gonna put some olive oil in my pan and start to heat it up. And this is gonna be for the potatoes. So instead of roasting them in the oven, I'm gonna be sauteing them. Does anybody else have to watch YouTube videos when they do anything? Cooking, cleaning, I always have YouTube videos on in the background. I think I was watching a BuzzFeed video in this clip. So you're just gonna dice up your little potatoes. And now for this, um, I was cooking the bacon and we don't have like a big pan to cook bacon on. We only have these little pans. And normally we do turkey bacon, but I wanted to try something new, so I got regular bacon, and this bacon was so long. I didn't even know what to do with myself. At first I thought maybe I was stretching it out, but that's just how long they were. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna fold it over, and then that didn't work, so I decided to cut them in half. This, is, this clip's a little bit of a hot mess. It took me a second to figure out what the heck I had going on. 
Later, I realized that after it's cooked, it shrinks a ton, so I could have just kept it like the full length. Um, turkey bacon is not this hard to cook, you guys. And then once your oil is hot, you just add some potatoes to the pan, kind of coat them in that olive oil, and then add whatever seasoning. Like I said, I just only ended up using the Mrs. Dash. Next, I wanted, um, while everything was cooking, just to get the stuff ready for the wrap. So I just went ahead and sliced my tomato. You guys, that's it. Now all I have to do is assemble the wrap. Um, you can do any way that you want. What I did is I just took the tortilla and then put some ranch on it and spread that out so that it was kind of covering the whole tortilla. Then I added the spinach next. Then I went ahead and added my turkey. Um, you have to make sure you add like a good amount, like not just one, like, you know, like one slice in each section. You kind of have to layer them. Now I just added the cheddar cheese. And tomatoes we aren't huge tomato people so I do cut them in half I'm not gonna get too crazy by putting three whole tomato slices <laughs> and then just some salt and pepper and then last but not least you just add your bacon on top and then you just roll it up it's seriously such an easy dinner, and it's pretty healthy. I mean, healthier than some of the dinners that we eat. And I just cut it, cut it in half to show you guys what it looked like on the inside, and it looked beautiful. And my potatoes have been cooking for probably about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, I did end up putting a lid on it, and this is what my dinner looks like. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, do not forget to check out Paige's channel. I'm going to go ahead and link her video as well as her channel down below. And if you guys are from Paige's channel, thank you so much for watching. I would love if you would subscribe. Um, keep a lookout for future videos. I do post about two to three times a week. And thank you guys so much for watching.